friends, it is Amy Esther here with my very first YouTube video and you guys, I am so excited to be here. I have wanted to do this for a long time now, but I'm finally doing it and I'm making lifestyle and mommy videos with chronic illness. So if you are interested in that, please hit that subscribe button. You do not want to miss my videos. Turn on the bell so that you get the notifications every time I post a new video. I'll post one every Monday and Thursday. And please comment if you have a chronic illness or if you are just struggling with something in life right now. We are going to go on this journey together. So I want to get to know you better. Leave me a comment. Tell me about you. And please give this video a thumbs up if you like it, if you want more, so that I can know what you guys want me to make. Today, I thought I would start by sharing a little bit about myself and just a general overview of my several chronic illnesses that I deal with on a daily basis. So, first off, my name is Amy Esther. I am from Utah. I am married to the best husband in the world. I love him so much. I have a sweet daughter and hope to have more children in the future. I am a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I am also a graduate of Brigham Young University, Idaho. I have a degree in math and health education. I was a math teacher for a while, not very long, because I got very, very sick. And I will tell you that whole story, I'm sure, in the future, but um, I was a teacher. I am 24 years old. I love health, and I love sharing about my health and about my journey. I've been sharing it through Instagram, so please go follow me there, Amy underscore Esther, if you would like to uh, follow along somewhere else besides YouTube. And I just love being a mother and a homemaker. It's the best job in the world, but it comes with some extra challenges because I have several chronic illnesses. So I have a little list here. If you see me looking down, it's because I wanna keep myself on track, make sure I don't forget anything. So first off, I have POTS, Postural Orthostatic Tachycardia Syndrome. POTS basically means when I stand, my blood pools at my feet and struggles to get back up to all of my vital organs. So it causes something called orthostatic intolerance, which I like to call standing intolerance. I'm intolerant to standing up. Uh, it can cause so many symptoms. If you can just imagine not having your blood circulate to all these different places. So POTS is kind of my main chronic illness. It causes more problems with the other chronic illnesses I have. It's a real struggle. So lots of videos coming up on that. Next, I have SIBO, a small intestine bacterial overgrowth. And I actually have a methane dominant SIBO, which means it's not actually a bacteria, which is crazy because it's called a bacterial overgrowth, but it's not a bacteria. They're learning more about it. Um, so they used to treat it with antibiotics and those did not help me. So I will do some videos about how to treat a methane dominant SIBO. Next is IBS, irritable bowel syndrome. It is super common. Um, I kind of feel like it's the last resort um, diagnosis that doctors give. And I felt like they, that's why they gave it to me. <laughs> um, but if you have been diagnosed with IBS, please go get tested for SIBO because it's similar symptoms, bloating, stomach pain, digestive systems, all the works. So if you're suffering from IBS and you haven't had anything help you, please go get tested for SIBO and just see if that could also be your problem. Um, leaky gut syndrome. This is not really accepted in the medical world, more in the holistic world. And I kind of like to combine the worlds. I use a little bit of medical, a little bit of holistic um, in my approach to my health. So leaky gut syndrome is basically increased intestinal permeability, meaning if I eat something with toxins or whatever other things are in the food, they can be leaked out into my bloodstream and cause problems other places. Next is chronic migraines. Most people know what a migraine is. Um, I get chronic migraines uh, quite often and I found some things to help me, so I will share those with you. Uh, fibromyalgia, which is widespread, widespread pain and fatigue. Um, this is pretty common, especially among women. And I think um, part of my fibromyalgia symptoms are kind of combined with POTS. I uh, might use those kind of interchangeably because I was diagnosed with fibromyalgia first. Anyways, it's a whole story. I'll explain it in my next video when I share my whole story about my chronic illnesses, but for a general overview, I have fibromyalgia, which is widespread pain and fatigue. 
Um, PCOS, polycystic ovarian syndrome. I have a very weird type of PCOS. I don't have the typical symptoms, so again, I'll do a whole video on it, but typical symptoms, not necessarily mine, are increased hair growth from high testosterone, um, uh, obesity from insulin resistance, irregular periods because you're not ovulating, polycystic ovaries, um, all of those fun things. So that's PCOS. Next is endometriosis, which is when the lining of the uterus moves outside of the uterus and attaches to other organs and things like that. Um, that needs to be removed laparoscopically through a surgery, which I have had, and it always comes back, which is super fun, but it's basically just super painful, especially during menstruation. Super fun. And the last two, anxiety and depression, which most people have heard of, I'm sure. Um, speaking of anxiety, you guys, my anxiety is through the roof. It's been through the roof since I decided to start this channel. It has stopped me from starting this channel for the past two whole years. I even made five or six videos once, and then I deleted all of them because my anxiety got so high. I got so nervous. I I don't know why. It, it doesn't make sense sometimes when I think about it, and then other times my brain just tells me that I just can't do these types of things. But we are overcoming this anxiety together. So you're gonna watch me as I go through this journey. Two videos a week for one year is my goal. So please subscribe so that I can know that you guys are supporting me and that you wanna see these videos that I'm making. So that is the end of this one and I will see you on the next video. Thank you so much for being here.